energy will rob you of your life that you know. My name is Clenda, and I've been living with myasthenia gravis for nine years. I had the droopy neck, the droopy finger, the droopy eyelids, and I lost a lot of strength in my core muscles. I would hold my head to eat. There was a point in time that I did not get in my own pool because I could not walk up the steps to get out. If I went out to dinner with friends, it would be a choice between me eating or talking because I couldn't do both. A lot of times I would put my boyfriend between myself and the other people so he could buffer the conversation. I just learned how to navigate and still be a part. So it's being there for others and sharing your story because by sharing your story, you just don't know how many others you are helping. They may be experiencing the same situation that you are, but they don't tend to talk about it. And by you sharing what you're going through is also educating others to look out for those things for themselves, to have that conversation with their doctors as well. What's next for me in my MG journey is that I hope to continue to get stronger. As I say, even after nine years, I'm still getting stronger every day. And that I can continue to be a strong advocate for all of us living with myasthenia gravis and rare diseases.